What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, welcome to the channel. So this is actually a product review. Uh, you'll have to excuse all this. Um, I didn't get off of work till like 8.30, which is five hours past what I normally do. We had a massive storm come through here and just tore up some power lines, man. So yeah, a lot of work get done today, but it got done. Uh, people got turned on, turned back on. That could be taken the wrong way. But you know what I mean, anyhow. So, yeah, let's get into this product review. Actually, this goes beyond product review. This goes to actual business review. So, um, a little while back, Amy, I think she posted about catching some catfish and stuff like that, and talking about filleting them and whatnot. And um, uh, Josh over at uh, First Degree Fuller said, uh, well, you need a good fillet knife. And uh, she said, yes, I do. So I, uh, you know, took that as a hint, and I jumped on messenger and I messaged Josh and I said hey how much would you charge me for a knife a fillet knife and he said well usually I do two 250 I think somewhere around there I was like well I want this thing custom man so um he was like well what do you want so I was like you know work your magic so basically it came in the other day Amy's already done her thing but let me show you on my channel just exactly what she got so this is the sheath, as you can see, and this is like a uh, like a, a pink, reddish, blue striped in there. Josh's wife did that. That is, it's awesome. Beautiful work. Absolutely beautiful work. Nice leather sheath. Nice leather sheath. And already, just looking at the outside, I'm like, yep, they take pride in their work. Before I show this to you, let me show you something else. Actually, no. Actually, no. Let me go ahead and show you the knife. So, when I got this thing, I was like, holy crap. And here it is. It is an absolute beauty. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that handle. The dyeing on that wood was awesomely done. This thing, guys, feels like a freaking featherweight. And you see, he has his touch mark there. Okay. And it's got beautiful color. It is so light. I can't remember what type of steel he said he used. But, um, but man, it just it feels good in the hand. It's well balanced. And I, I, I think I could probably fillet, really fillet some good stuff up here. You know, I, I probably circumcise a gnat with this thing, honestly. But uh, it wasn't just that, so customized, you know, of course, the colors. Amy's like certain colors. Her name was etched into it. I don't know if you can see that. I'm trying to get it. There we go. Beautifully done. And this is, is just, it's a masterpiece. It's beautiful. You can't ask for no better. Guys, it's so light. It's so light, I would think it's an aluminum knife. Um... I would say it's even lighter than, than the um, ceramic knives you can buy. The ceramic shift knives and stuff. And it just feels so good. I mean, I could just really slice some pe um, pork and chicken and fish up. I think I said that. So, uh, that's the product review. Beauty, beautiful, beautiful piece. And so now, this is where the review goes into the business portion. Along with it came not only first degree forged stickers, in which I might try to steal from Mamie so I can put more stickers on the back of my truck. I already got an island made of a forged sticker back there. Um, on the glass, don't put it on the paint because I've already heard stories that these stickers stick. They stick. That's what they're supposed to do, they're stickers, but these like stick, like extremely stick, like super sticky. And, um, so I put it on the glass in case I ever have to take it off or something like that, or it just the sun fades it off and I have to scrape it off. It's going to be a whole lot easier to scrape off. And glass doesn't scratch as easy as, say, um, as, as your paint job will. So, And I can use acetone to get the stuff off, and it won't dull the paint, the clear coat on it. Anyhow, <clears throat> this was in there with it, too. Railroad spike. Just a cheap piece of metal, guys cheap piece of metal and at first I was like oh is this a mess up and I was like wait a minute there's no cracks and he 
ground down to bevels. I was like, holy crap. And yeah, I talked about this in the video. This is the this is the quality that you get with first degree forge when you order from them. He tested out and made sure that the design was what it needed to be, how to do it so that when he went into using the actual steel, there was no mess ups. He knew exactly what he needed to do. And this is the type of um, craftsmanship that you will get, not only just in the piece itself, but in the actual testing and making sure that it is right. So, um, really didn't take him that long to get it out either. I mean, the guy's an awesome bladesmith. He's an absolute awesome bladesmith. So, you know, he tested it out, and then he went into making the, the blade here. And as you can see, they're not much different. They're about the same length. The finger wrist there is a little bit wider. But the weight is miles apart, guys. Miles apart. This is just an exquisitely awesome, beautiful piece. And I couldn't be more happier for it. I bought American. I bought local. And I am helping to keep, trying to help keep people afloat. I'm trying. But this was just an absolute beauty of a piece. And the fact that he threw this in there let me know that he took extra time to make sure that he got it right. So, um, awesome job, guys. Check out Josh's channel, First Degree Forge, if you haven't already. Subscribe to him. Uh, he's going to start doing live streams again, thank God. But uh, if you're not subscribed to him, you're not going to see him in a regular feed. He usually um, um, keeps his stuff for above 18. You know, he's going to be him. And he knows who he is, and there's nothing wrong with that. There's absolutely nothing wrong with individuality. I like the guy just fine. I don't think that he really does anything that's harmful to need only 18 plus. But check him out, guys. First Degree Forge. First Degree Forge. Check him out. Beautiful work. Order something from him, man. I mean, it's just beautiful, beautiful work. And when he told me he was sending this out, man, it was there in like two days. So I think he like expressed it or something like that. I'm not sure. But, um... But his wife just, God, man. The two of them make a hell of a team. I'll say that. And with saying that, I say this. Smile today if you haven't smiled. Life's worth living. Don't worry. Don't worry. We will get through this storm. This desert, even deserts have rain. Okay? It rains in the desert. Trust me, I know I've been there when it did it. But um, eventually, all this mess will come to an end. All right? We can go back to normal lives. Look out for one another. Help one another out. Love, peace, chicken grease. Peace.